Hello everybody, it's BlockyDuck, and welcome back to another video. In today's video, I am going to be showing you how to download and install World Edit for Minecraft 1.16.5. Alright everybody, let's go ahead and jump right into today's video. Alright everybody, so the first thing that you want to do is you want to go ahead and click on the first link in the video description and that's going to be the link to the World Edit mod on CurseForge and this is just the place where you are going to download and install World Edit for Minecraft 1.16.5. Now, what you want to do is Whenever you click on this link, it's going to show the description. You want to click where it says files on the right hand side and that's going to go ahead and load up all of the different files that are available for um, world edit. So in this case, you can see that we have um, a file at the top here. So this is the Forge version. There are actually two versions of world edit that you can download. There is the Forge version and then there is the Fabric version. And so what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and download the Fabric version, but um, you can also download the Forge version. And I will also put a video in the description showing you how to download and install Forge for Minecraft 1.16.5. But anyways, before you download Download World Edit for Fabric. You want to go ahead and install Fabric, and you can do that by clicking on the second link in the video description, and that's going to be the Fabric Installer. So whenever you click on the Fabric Installer, um, you want to go ahead and click on where it says Download Installer Universal Jar. Even if you do have a Windows computer, I would still recommend downloading the one on the left here, this Universal Jar one. So I'm going to go ahead and do that, and then click on where it says Keep, and it's going to go ahead and finish downloading. And in the meantime, we can download World Edit. So right here, World Edit Fabric for Minecraft 1.16.3, 4, and 5. So um, it is compatible for all of these versions right here. So in order to download World Edit, just click on this orange download button right here. And once again, if you choose to download the Forge version, go ahead and click on the Forge one, which is right above the Fabric one. The Forge one is actually the one that was up. Uh, at the top. So right here, just go ahead and click on keep again. And now we're going to install fabric. So in order to install fabric, you want to go ahead and um, click on this little arrow right here in Google Chrome and go ahead and click on where it says open. And then this is going to bring up the fabric download page. And right here, it's going to go ahead and show the fabric installer and you can choose your version. So Minecraft 1.16.5 is the version we want to use. Um, and then when all you have to do is just make sure it says 1.16.5 and go ahead and click on install and then it will say done and then um, just go ahead and click on where it says OK and close out of the Fabric Installer. So now that we have Fabric installed, now we're ready to go ahead and install World Edit. And once again, if you choose to download Minecraft Forge with World Edit, that is also perfectly fine. Uh, World Edit works for both Fabric and Forge. So now what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and click on Show in Folder. And this is just going to open up our Downloads folder. And at this point, we can close out of Google Chrome and minimize to our desktop. So we already have our downloads folder open, but we're going to open up another folder. And in order to do that, we're going to go ahead and enter the search bar and type in percentage, app data percentage, and then click on this file folder right here. Now just go ahead and click on .minecraft and click on where it says mods. And you're just going to drag the world edit mod into the mods folder. Now what if you don't have a mods folder? If you don't have a mods folder, then you need to create a mods folder. If you've never installed a mod before, then you need to create a mods folder. To do that, you can go ahead and right click in the app that of uh, Minecraft folder, click on where it says new, and click on where it says folder, and then just name this folder um, mods, M-O-D-S, click OK, and I already have one created so it's going to pop up this little error message but for you if you have just created a mods folder and you only have one of them then it will successfully create and you can just um drag the world edit mod into the mods folder i hope that makes sense the only reason it didn't work for me is because i already have a mods folder but if you've never installed a mod before then just go ahead and create a new mods folder name it mods all lowercase and then drag the world edit file into the mods folder and that's literally all you have to do now you can just close out of all of these folders and we can open up the minecraft launcher and we'll go ahead and let it load up here there we go. And it will, um, there should be an option 
for fabric. Okay, there we go. I just closed um, back out and then reopened it. And here is the fabric loader for 1.16.5. And if you downloaded World Edit for the Forge version, um, the Forge for 1.16.5 will show up right here. And, it'll just, and it should just automatically show up. If it doesn't show up, you can always click on Installations plus new and then under the version click on where it says release fabric loader 1.16.5 or release forge um 1.16.5 and click and then what you're going to want to do is click create and then you can just click play right here and then click little checkbox and then click play but anyways that's just if it doesn't show up right here the first time and like i did you may have to close out and then reopen it up but anyways I don't really want to confuse you, so it should just automatically show up right here, and then you can click on where it says play, and then just click in this little checkbox and click play, and then we'll go ahead and let Minecraft load up with Fabric 1.16.5. So Minecraft is loaded up and here we are in a game and to just validate that we have installed world edit correctly if we type in the command slash slash and then do wand um, the world edit axe will appear and we can just do some basic commands so if we set this as We'll just do smooth zone. Then you can see that World Edit is working successfully. And that's pretty much all you have to do in order to download and install World Edit. And then if you're on the Forge version, you can also um, just go to the home screen. And there will be a little section that says mods. And if you click on that, it'll show the World Edit mod. But the Fabric version doesn't provide that. So anyways, thanks for watching this video. And I hope that you enjoyed it. I hope that you were able to successfully download and install World Edit. And if you want to learn how to use World Edit, I also have a video about that. So I will go ahead and put that video as like the little end screen thing. And you can just click on that video if you have no idea how to use World Edit and you want to learn the basics. Uh, World Edit is a really cool mod that you can use to make building a lot faster and easier. And I would definitely recommend downloading it and using it. But anyways, thanks for watching and have a great day.